Tom, thank you. Affordable housing isn't easy to find these days, especially with reports showing a nationwide shortage of more than 7 million affordable rental homes. Arkansas is not immune, but as THV 11's Brooke Buckner shows us, Little Rock City leaders are working to change that. Yeah, Rowley and Faith, this morning, Mayor Frank Scott Jr. and other city leaders broke ground on 16 new homes for low to moderate income families. It's all a part of the mayor's goal to create 100 new affordable housing units. <laughs> Turning over dirt to clear the way for more affordable homes. I mean, anytime you get it to help uh, individuals and families provide them decent and affordable housing and they have an opportunity to create some home ownership and have a place that they can call their own. It always feels great. Kevin Howard with the Little Rock Department of Housing and Neighborhood Program says building 16 new homes in the city's sixth ward is a step in the right direction for decreasing the affordable housing shortage. Anybody can find a house but the key is being able to find affordable housing for that low to moderate income person or family so they can access and wouldn't be over their head for debt to, debt to income ratio to be able to get into the home and be comfortable with a payment. That way they won't be struggling. Howard estimates hundreds in the city are on a waiting list to move into low cost housing. We want to provide a sense of pride, a sense of home ownership, give these individuals and families the opportunity get into these homes with no money down. Uh, we'll provide up to a $20,000 subsidy so they can uh, apply for that to receive assistance to get into these homes. Mayor Frank Scott says he wants to see even more affordable homes in Little Rock. Two years ago, he set his goal to create 100 new housing units. Uh, to date, we've already laid the infrastructure uh, for close to 35 to 36 homes. Uh, 20 of those homes have already been sold, uh, utilizing our down payment assistance as well as uh, our subsidies that we work with, uh, the Housing Urban Development Program within the federal government. We are very grateful because we know that this helps us close racial wealth gaps here in the city of Little Rock because if you can have a home, you can build equity. If you can build equity, you can build wealth. Howard expects the homes to be finished in the next year and a half.